Hello and welcome to Vanadeal. I don't believe I've ever done a Final Fantasy XI video, so let's do one. I'm wearing my <laughs> fantastic Harvest Festival outfit, by the way, uh, for Halloween, complete with the uh, Keichi uh, pants there. Absolutely fantastic. So I've not played um, much of XI, honestly. It's, it's something that's kind of like a guilty um, thing of mine. I like to play it. Uh, just simply because I never got the chance to. Play online was one of the biggest problems. But anyway, there we go, a Final Fantasy XI video. So I want to show off a mount today because a lot of people in the community, from what I can understand, have been after an Ixion mount in this game for many, many years, ever since they got stuff like the Fenrir mount in this game. So mounts are relatively on the small amount in comparison to things like Final Fantasy XIV and other MMOs. There's not that many of them. But yes, so there is actually an event taking place. And if you want to take part and obviously take advantage of this, all you have to do is uh, log in sometime from today, the 10th of November. It started at 3 p.m. GMT, all the way until um, the exchange, last exchange point was the 9th of December 2022 at 2 p.m. GMT. Uh, you can get your last points on the 2nd of December. You can essentially get what? 1500 600 1600 points in a login campaign this is the one obviously for november um yeah let's let's have a look at this so the ixion mount you need to come to any of the greeter mootle the uh, mootles the greeter moogles uh you can find this one specifically i'm over here in bastok or wherever at the port at uh this is i believe j12 slash j13 technically j13 if you think about it uh wow yeah this is this is a very crazy thing to do i've never done an 11 video the greeter moogles will uh, exchange uh, they'll also tell you how many points you've got in the brackets as you can see down there but this is a 500 point mount in particular uh, as you can see so we get the ixion mount for 500 points which is uh you you essentially get 500 points I believe for your initial login and then 100 points thereafter so all you have to do is you know come back to vanadeel and log in um the worst case scenario just wait five days basically you'll earn points every time you log in um yeah so let's have a look at this it says an astral notebook inscribed with sheet music on how to make a call appealing to an ixion can be shown to mapipoto in upper juno for recording so you may ride ixion so we're going to Get this, boop, and now we have the Ixion uh, mount, essentially, and that's brought us down to 1,500. There are lots of other mounts that you can get. Those are usually at the 300 point range, as you can see here when it loads. There's Gooboos, there's a Crab, Beetle, um, there's also some Glamour stuff, look, like the Cumulus Mask, uh, Blizzard Brand there, level one old jobs, uh, Sword, all sorts of other bits and pieces. We've also got the Dalmore mount, the Golden Bomb, Iron Giant, which I think is is a must-have personally, and there's also a, a, another bunch of stuff. I'll link the the login rewards page so you can go and have a look at that. But let's go and have a look at this particular mount. All right, here we are in Upper Juno, and we need to go to G7 uh, to Mapatoto, which is the uh, the guy who deals with mount training. So we're going to go over there now. Uh, just so you are remembering, because it's been a while since I've played it as well. That's uh, near the Chocobo Stables instead. Like, it's, it's downstairs from that. Oh, boy. Yeah, I really wish I had spent more time playing this game. It is something that I do regret growing up. But, uh, yeah, it was it was not for the faint of heart. It still isn't, is it? Final Fantasy XI. Okay, so to do this, we need to target Mapatoto, and then we go to the trade function, and then we trade them the mount that we want to learn. I picked up some others. We're going to look at the Ixion then. Trade that there. And now we're going to have that registered into our trainer's whistle. Da -da -da -da. <laughs> nice. As easy as that. And then we have access to our Ixion companion mount. Alrighty, with that sorted and we've now got that accessible, let's just go to Batilia Downs and have a look at this particular mount then. I'm very excited to see what this is like. 
Um, obviously, it should look like Dark Ixion from Final Fantasy XI, but uh, we'll, we'll, we will soon find out. At least it looked like like that on the um, the login rewards page. Let's have a look. Okay. Where's our mounts? I always forget. Right, it's abilities, mounts. There we go. I'm still fairly new at this. Okay, I do apologize. There's Ixion. There it is. Look at this. Oh, that looks fantastic. <laughs> so yeah, it is based on Dark Ixion. Very nice. I'm actually uh, a fan of that. That looks beautiful, doesn't it? Look at it in uh, in motion as well. Very cool stuff. Yeah, so hopefully they um, they go with this tech and then go. Uh, let's have the Odin mount because a lot of people would love to have sleep near. There's <laughs> just a bunch of people on it. So yeah, if you want to make the most out of a mount that honestly, I, I would say it's one of the most sought after that's most requested. Log in. Get your campaign points. Get a really cool looking mount. If you're a new player like myself, don't be put off. You know, it's very easy to get stuff like this, and it's, it's a great way of breaking the ice. Look at all these cool characters, and there's me and my scr <laughs> my scrubby level 50 red mage. <laughs> very cool stuff. I do approve. Yeah, but hope hopefully they do more, um, more mounts like this, right? For 11. It's great to see 11 getting more content. Really, really cool stuff. And obviously, you can look at some of the mounts and, and things you have in 11 and be like, this would be really nice in 14 as well. Anyway, enjoy the rest of your day. I just thought I'd make a quick video. This is awesome. Have a great day. I'll see you all next time. Bye-bye.